Hey guys, this is Emerald Fire, and I'm back with some cool stuff I made with the new test4 command. First up, we have an admins only door. We'll just turn off the lock, and since I'm in creative mode, I can walk right through. However, if I change to survival mode, it won't open. This is pretty straightforward. It is a clock hooked up to a command block that checks for players with game mode 1 within a range of 3. Then it outputs the signal from the comparator and goes through two torches and opens the door. Next up, we have some wireless redstone. I'll press this button, and that lamp will turn on. I'll press it again, and the lamp will turn off. This one works by quickly giving the person who presses the button 9,999 experience points, which this clock checks for. And then it sends out a signal to this to immediately take them away, as well as change this T flip clock which pushes the redstone block into the lamp and back out from it. Next up, we have a really simple and styleable XP shop. So if you have a certain amount of XP, you can buy these things. So I'll give myself 50 levels. Now I can buy a sword. And, hold on, let me just get rid of that chat box. You can see my levels went down 30. If I try to buy another sword, it won't let me. But now I can buy a bow and a wood pickaxe. This is really compact and it is titleable, which means you can put them right next to each other. The first command block checks for the number of XP needed to buy the item. The one below the piston checks, or actually subtracts the cost, and the third one gives the player the item. Finally, I have made an adder using the test4 command and the player's XP levels. You may recall my command block adder in my video called command block logic gates. Uh, that one required teleporting the player though. This one does not. So, uh, and this is all in binary. So I'll add 4 plus 6. That will give me 10, which is 1010. Zero, one zero. There it is. Okay. Now we'll do something else. How about 64 plus um, 40? That'll give 102. Which, let's see, so 64 plus 32 is 96 plus 8 is 104. Did I, did I add that wrong? Yeah, I added that wrong. Okay. Well, anyway, this one works. It's not too compact, but it also works by giving the player a certain number of levels, and then each of these checks to see if the player has at least that many levels, and then subtracts that many levels, and moves on to the next. Then it goes to this one, then this one. And this comes up here and goes into the display, the redstone lamps. I'll post the world file as a download link. Uh, this is also the video that, uh, the world that I did my previous video on the command blocks on. So this is all here too. So I will post this 
as a link in the description. But that's all for now, so thanks for watching!